Hi, it's Colin Mew here from MTM TV. I'm here on a very wet Friday night. We're across from Future Heads. So how did set go, mate? Yeah, we loved it. You know, it was a bit of a risk coming and playing acoustic and acapella at Leeds Festival, but yeah, yeah we loved it. Yeah. Cause you're not, you don't really do um, much acoustic sort of acapella stuff, so was it different to your normal sort of plug in stuff? Like, what was the vibe like? Was it a lot different? Yeah, I mean, massively different because obviously electric guitars, um, it, it has the like, it has the power. It, you can feel it on stage. You know that you, you're drowning out everything else. Whereas with this, it's very uh, stripped back and loose. And the, the crowd, if they wanted to, could ruin it. But the crowd, in fact, made it instead tonight. It looked like it was a really good crowd. I mean, it sounded great. But how does like Leeds compare to the festivals we play? Well, Leeds was the one we used to come to as, as kids, as blunt as ourselves, so it always is going to be special for us, but we've played it so many times, but the first time like this, so it, it almost feels like a, a new experience. How would you sort of sum it up in one word? Then? One word? Yeah, one word. Oh, man. Well, oh, it's, it's very difficult because for us, we're always like super, super nervous about doing this stuff in... Uh, in, in different environments, you know, the tour was all seat there and stuff, so uh, pleasantly surprising. It was a little cover, cover it, like. <laughs> and um, of course, you're playing Shepherd's Bush in September, yeah, that's right. and then Split Festival, you're looking forward to that. Yeah, we well, Split Festival is the one we organise ourselves, so that's always that's always great up in Sunderland. Uh, we've got some really, really special special acts on there this year as well. Hopefully, we'll see you there um, with Steve and Gigstocks. Absolutely, mate, yeah. yeah. And I mean, obviously, the northern the northern music scene is like, it's amazing. Like, right now, it's like sort of going back to your stadium, how it was. I mean, like, in terms of music, like, who are your influences from the north? The north, uh, well, I mean, they might not be known by everybody, but there's a great band from the northeast called uh, Punishment of Luxury, a punk band from the late 70s who we really like a lot. Um, we really well. shared a rehearsal room for about eight years with field music, so we're always close with those guys. And uh, you know, just to be honest, I mean, Frank and Art Strings, yeah. uh, Spoken Words, we're just a close knit group of people, so everyone, hopefully, I would like to say, inspires each other, you know. It's the economy of MTMTV.